I always get asked, Nathan, who's the most gangster person you know? To which I always apply, my grandma. And here's why. Where is your key? I forgot, my key's at home. Come in, you get one key. That means she loves me. That's wicked, boy. It's got all the lingo on point. Extra good. She's down with the kids. She does knitting, yeah? Makes her scarves and sells them on. Do that. Make it. Do that. Make it. Make it rain. When I was about five or six years old, she made my teacher cry. I didn't do her anything. You made her cry. She don't know you like we know you. So she, she's probably thinking, oh, she's going to kill me. And that's why she started crying. If I want to kill Mrs. Um, nobody will see when I do it. But they will see her fall. <laughs> well, how to get away from her now? They don't mess with me from time gone by. OK, so we are here to buy some uh, wool for making her scarves and blankets so she can sell on, make that paper. They don't have the red one. The red thread. I'm going to hold you and beat you up, you know. You can't beat strangers. She threatens strangers and doesn't care. You're letting me come and Ganga, go. Ganga. Chill. I'm coming back after you. I, Stop. I, I apologise. She's in the back seat, officer. If they interfere with you, stand up for your right. Most people are scared of the police. Not my grandma. They can cuff me if they want to cuff me. But they have to get me first. <laughs> so gangster. <laughs> we in a spot in this life. Tell your peeps stop by. Too many flag goes around. Take your thing off, man. It's good. It's okay, it's fine. It's your money or your life. Thank you. All right, in a bit, Mama. Okay, yeah. okay then. Bye bye. Okay. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>